All right, welcome Emma and Shelly. You are our first contestants on our very random and completely unexpected game show, The Burst TV Pop-Up Game. That's right, folks. This is our first ever Burst TV Games. My name is Charlotte. This is my co-host and co-judge for today, Miss Micah Lewis. Say hello, Miss Micah. Hi, girls. Where are you and who would you like to say to out there in, on YouTube land? I would like to say I would have rather been able to fix my hair today. <laughs> and, and I would like to say that I just, said, this works. I just said, look, ladies, I haven't even take I haven't even been in the shower yet today because I've been busy. Okay, moving on, Micah, who would you like to say hi to? I'd like to say um, all, hi to all of our friends and family out there. So today our special guests are lovingly known as Shima because they work together. They're basically partners in crime here at Burst, connected at the hip, and they love surprises like this. Girls, let's take a moment to get to know you. Emma, why don't you tell us where you live and are there any special people that you'd like to say hello to? Yes, sure. So I am Emma Morris. I'm a registered dental hygienist and work here for Burst with my amazing partner, Shelly. Uh, I live in Georgia, so... Um, yeah, I, I guess I can say hello to my family. I have two little girls and a husband and um, a, um, I don't know, way to hit me on the spot here, Charlotte. <laughs> it's perfect. All right, Charlotte, let's get to know you. Where are you? Um, oh, Charlotte, I'm going to get you for this one. If I'd have known, I would have looked much better than I do right now. So, hey, everyone. I'm Shelly Kaiser. I live in Racine, Wisconsin. Uh, work full time for Burst with my amazing partner, Emma. Uh, I have five daughters, one grandson, and I guess I would like to just shout out them because they're very supportive. Oh, I love it. All right, so to prepare for this epic game, I do need you both to grab two sheets of paper and something to write with. All right. All right, Shelly's ready to go. Emma, you're ready to go. You have your utensils. All right, Mike, take it over. Okay, so for the first round of the games, it is a pop quiz worth one point each. For our first round, you're gonna have to answer two questions. So you'll write your answers on the piece of paper and you'll reveal them at the same time. You will get one point for each correct answer, and in the event that you're both wrong, the closest answer will win. Are you ready? Bring it on. Okay. Charlotte's going to keep the time. Since we, it's in October, we're going to go with the theme for the month. Charlotte, are you ready? I'm ready to go. Let's do it. The first question is, pumpkins originated in what country? Five. All right, that's 10 seconds, ladies. At the same time, are you ready to reveal your answers? Sure. All right, show us what you got. I said Germany. I said US. I don't know. I'm so sorry. Thank you for playing, but you're both incorrect. The correct answer, Micah? Central America. Who, who's closer to Central America would, would be Emma. So I'm, I'm Emma. just going to... I'm going to give Emma half a point for that. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> okay. Question two. What percentage of water are pumpkins? And go. Time's up. Put your pencils down. All right. At the same time. Let's reveal your answers. What percentage of water are pumpkins? 55%. 80%. Oh, guess who takes that round? Shelly. Shelly gets it. Pumpkins are 90% water. Yep. 
One point for Shelly, half a point for Emma. <laughs> All right. No, you're going to get the competitive ones here. I will <laughs> tell you because she needs to win this because her competitive nature here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. In this next round, this one is worth five points. We call it quick draw. Ladies, we need to both keep your pen and paper handy. I'm going to text you both objects that you're going to need to draw. You will have one minute to artistically express this item on paper. Micah is going to set the timer. And then when time is up, one by one, you're going to show us your lovely creations. Micah and I are going to guess, or actually Micah is going to guess what you drew because she has no idea what I'm sending you. Are you ladies ready for your text message? I'm ready. Oh, boy. Are you ready? Micah, are you ready with the timer? The timer has started. Can't wait to see this lovely creation. I'm so excited. Well, lots of focus going on right now. No, they're, they're concentrated. Thirty seconds left. Oh, oh. Emma, did you finish early? She's I'm done. Oh, All right. Oh, well, well, they're both done. done. Need a full minute. Timer stopped. Let's see your creations. All right, let's do. Yeah, let's do Emma first. Oh, a ghost with a burst brush. <laughs> yes, you got it. All right, Emma definitely took the five points on that one. Shelly, are you also going to get five points for your- You know what I did? No, I'm not. Because I drew, I did it, I do the same thing. <laughs> uh, judges, do you think that Shelly also gets five points for her creation? Let's take a close look at this though. Yeah, let's, see a, let's see a better look at Shelly's drawing. Yes, I would agree oh. that Shelly also gets the five points. All right, I think you both get five points for that. Hey, how is that right? First was supposed to be something <laughs> totally different. Because <laughs> you didn't read the whole message. <laughs> Minus five points because she didn't follow directions. You're right. That's true. So Shelly earned a life lesson, and we Shelly did get the zero point. A reprieve here at Burst. That's right. We do a Burst Summer Service uh, chance on Oh, wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, for the next round, it is going to be a scavenger hunt worth 10 points. So lots of points up for grabs here. In this round, you're both going to go on a hunt for the same item we call out to you. The first person back to the computer with the item will win this round. Are you ready? Except I have to rip my earphones out. Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> bring it on. Okay, we'd like you to bring back a pumpkin. Cool. Oh, Emma. <laughs> Emma takes that one with flying colors. She didn't even have to leave her seat. Hey. Oh, goodness, I put my fall decorations out. I, I had a feeling, we were talking about this previously, I had a feeling that you guys would have decorations really uh, close by. <laughs> All right, guys, are you ready for the final round of the Burst TV game show? Yes, we Would are. you rather? This one is worth 20 points. Oh, this is a favorite game here around Burst. We're going to play Would You Rather. You will each be given a question. Your answers uh, will be judged by our audience. That's right. We're going to depend on viewer comments. So you'll need to give us, give us your answer and the reason why you answered that way. And our YouTube audience is going to decide who wins this final round. Remember, it's worth 20 points, so it's super important. Shelly, are you ready? I'm ready. Would you rather have a terrible allergic reaction to face paint or have a terribly embarrassing costume malfunction in public? Um, I would rather have a terrible reaction to face paint. I do not want to be out in public with the costume malfunctioning anywhere. <laughs> I can tell you that right now. And my, and my answer for that also is because you have me on YouTube as a surprise. And look, there's nothing on my face right now. So if I had an allergic reaction, it would probably be an improvement to this non-showered Shelly Kaiser, right? We're not, now. we're not having any of that. You are beautiful in every way. I brushed my hair with my hands. I just happened to put some eyeliner on. We, Micah 
then I'm ready for this. My real answer is really like, and I'm not shy. You all know me. I'm not shy, but I would not want my costume to malfunction in a public place. So let my face turn red. It'd be fine. It'll heal. All right. It's going to be up to YouTube if they like that answer, but we're going to go to Emma. Emma, here is your would you rather question. Would you rather be super sweaty all night long in a really hot onesie costume or be freezing all night long in a thin and tiny costume when a cold snap suddenly moves through your town? Hmm. I think I would rather be cold. I do not like to be hot. And if I was cold, then I wouldn't smell. And if I was sweaty, then I might would smell. So. I think I'll go with the thin costume because then I can always put more clothes on because you didn't say we couldn't do that. So. Oh, all right. Well, I'm not going to give you my opinion, but everybody on YouTube land, this winner is going to be determined by you. We want everyone to leave your comments below to tell, tell us who won this final round because according to my notes, uh, Emma had 15, 16 and a half, or no, 15 and a half points. And Shelly was behind her with six points, which means this last round is going to determine the winner. For the birthday ambassadors out there, the winner will be announced in our Facebook group on Monday. So make sure to get your votes in. For the rest of the world, we're going to put the results in the comments as well. And because their fate is in your hands, I'll be happy to announce that they will be crowned the victorious winner of this first ever Burst TV Games. And they get to choose their opponent for the next round. Ooh. Thank you girls for playing. Good luck. And we will see you on the next Burst TV Games. Everybody, make sure to subscribe to this channel if you thought this was entertaining, embarrassing, or otherwise <laughs> delightful in any way. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Thanks for having me. <laughs>